Stop recording. Stop recording. Button. Yes, I'm off. Hello, everybody, and welcome to video number two. I apologise this has been a little while going up. I do plan to start putting them up more regular in the future. So, video number two is going to be something different. We're going to be doing an audio game today. I'm going to be playing through the first section of an audio game. The game is called A Blind Legend. And I'm going to play up until we kill the first main enemy, who is called the Brain Eater. So, I would like to say before this video starts, I would advise you not to allow young children to listen to this video because there is a bit of language in it as part of the game. However, it doesn't detract from the enjoyability of the game and the only reason I'm mentioning it is because if you're listening to it and there's young children in the room, you may not want them to hear it. So I just wanted to make that disclaimer before we start. So today I'm going to be playing a bit of this game and I'll explain to you what it is. So it's called A Blind Legend. It's an audio game. It's based on sound. You it's are... The character is named Edward Blake. He's blind and he's a knight. And the object of the game is to rescue your wife, guided by your daughter, who is being kidnapped. So you and your daughter have to journey across the kingdom to rescue your wife. There are obstacles to face, there are enemies to fight, and there are things you have to do during the game. It's absolutely brilliant, and I would highly recommend it. I think even sighted people would enjoy this game, because it is like a video game. If you have a game controller, um, you can use that to play it. You can get it from iPhone App Store, Android App Store. You can get it on Windows and Mac. Although I think on Windows you need a Steam account, but I'm not 100% certain of that. On Mac, you can just get it from the Mac App Store. On the Mac and Windows, it does cost. On the iPhone and Android, last I checked, it was free. It's an absolutely enriching environment. I think you'll really enjoy it. It uses binaural 3D audio technology, which is the latest technology out there and it gives you an enriched audio environment. During the demonstration, I'm not going to talk much because the game explains itself and it's like, it gives you a tutorial as you're playing through the game on different things you can do. So, there's little need for me to say anything. So, I'm going to be using the arrow keys mainly, left, right, up and down. So, if I need to fight and the enemy's on the left, I'll use the left. If he's in front of me, I'll use up. If he's on my right, I'll use right. So, I just want to let you know that that's the main keys I'll be using to do things. Because, as I say, I don't really want to talk much during the demonstration. As I want you to get the full experience of this game. Hope you all enjoy. Feel free to ask questions. And feel free to get the game if you like it. The only reason I'm only going to play to the first enemy is because I don't want to spoil the game for you. So I'm hoping that this will give you enough of an appetite to want to try it for yourselves. So, enjoy. And I hope this is an immersive experience for you all. So, we're just opening the game. As I've already got it ready. And I'm going to, I'm going to skip through the intro... Loading. Welcome to A Blind Legend. Main menu. Continue a game. To go back to the main me new game. Select a scene. Change language. Settings. Credits. Quit. Continue a game. New game. So we're going to go to new game. So if you want to go back to the main menu at any time, you can just press escape. So enter on new game. Do you really want to start again from the beginning? This will erase your current save. Press enter to confirm, or escape to cancel. Yes, we do. Select your difficulty mode. Normal. There's normal and hardcore, and I'm just going to press right arrow. Hardcore. Normal. So I'm going to play normal. I've actually completed it on normal, but I'm going to play it on normal for the benefit of this demonstration. So if I do need to talk a little bit more, 
I can, but hopefully I won't. I think this will all be self-explanatory, and I hope you enjoy. So here goes. Let's go on an adventure together. Loading. This way, Father. You embody Edward Blake, the famous blind knight, and you will be guided by your daughter Louise. To move forwards, press up. You will keep moving as long as you keep the key pressed down. Now it's your turn. So I'm pressing the apparel to move. To move, perfect. You know how to move forward. You can move faster by pressing left shift. You can move slower by pressing left control. Or, if you are on a Mac OS, by pressing left command. Now it's time to play. So we're going to move fast. To move backwards, press down. You will keep moving as long as you keep the key pressed down. Now it's time to play. So I'm using down arrow, moving backwards. Perfect. You know how to move backward. To turn round, press left or right. You will keep turning as long as the key is pressed down. Now it's your turn. So I'm going to turn all the way around so you'll hear the environment. Good. By turning it like this, you can change direction while moving, guided by the sounds you hear. Whenever you need Louise to tell you how to reach her, press spacebar. Now it's time to play. Okay, so she's on my left, so I'm going to slightly turn left. Turn left. On your left. It's straight ahead. So now she's central. Normally I'd just walk and do it at the same time, but I just wanted to show you how to line up. So I'm now centred her, so I'm going to walk to her. All right. Each time you reach your daughter, she will tell you and set off for your next destination. Now it's your turn. Come, Father. Let's go and join Mother at the village square. This way. Okay, off we go. Whenever you hear this sound, an important thing is about to happen. What's that? The king's gun! Take her! Don't touch me! Let me go! Come on! Mother! Where is the cripple? I don't know. In the name of folks, speak or I'll cut you open, please! I beg of you! Find Blake! Lord Blake! You. you cannot stay here. You must hide. Miss Louise, take your father to the courtyard. There are too many of them, Father. Come! Whenever you hear this sound, it's your turn to play. To the next scene. Loading. Sir Blake, my father has finished your sword. It's at the forge. Okay, so I'm going to run towards the forge. I can hear it. I can hear it straight in front of me. So I'm following Louise and the sound of the hammer on the anvil. To draw out or put away your sword, press enter. 
you can't move with your sword in your hand. Your heartbeat reflects your health. The more you get hit, the faster it gets. Once the action is finished, Blake automatically puts away his sword. The soldiers! They're coming back! Flee, my lord. And stay off the road. Thank you. Get your things, Louise. We're going to free your mother. Loading. Where are we going, Father? We must cross the plain to reach the forest and enter into Thork's kingdom. Hurry up! The storm is close! an obstacle in front of you. Press up. So we're in the cave. Father? Hmm. Do you think that mother is all right? Hi, Louise! Quickly! When the enemy growls aggressively, press the key corresponding to his position to strike him. Do not strike too soon or too late. Wait for the right moment. So he's in front of me, so I'm going to press up at the right time. To block with your shield, press F. You will stay protected as long as you hold the key down. While you're protected, analyze the enemy's behavior to hit him at the right moment. So I'm pressing. time okay I'm satisfied now he's always in front of me It's all right. We must sleep now. We have a long journey ahead of us. Okay, so all you do when you're fighting is you listen, to, you listen to where the enemy is and you, you press the arrow key corresponding to where they are. Let's go, Louise. Can you see the forest in the distance? Yes, Father. It's this way. Follow me. Let's go. More fucking soldiers. Oh, 
Oh, we've got some visitors. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> well, look here. A cripple and his brat. Keep moving, mercenaries. Glad the old cripple. Head over your girl first. And the girl. <laughs> Let me go! Let her go, scum! Who are you talking, scum, cripple? Why don't you come here? Let me slice you. <laughs> During your fight, try to work out your enemy's position. You can hear him on the right, the left, or straight in front of, or behind you. When he's about to strike, press the key corresponding to his position to strike him. Do not strike too soon or too late. Wait for the right moment. Alright, come here. I'm gonna knock your head off. So he's on me right. Let her go, scum! Get out of here, scum! Don't let me see you around. Are you hurt? What is it? On the other side of the forest resides one of the seven guardians of Thork's kingdom. They call him the Brain Eater. The Brain Eater? Loading. Okay, so we're going on now. To the next thing. You're close. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Where are we, Father? It's so cold. It's the Whispering Wood. The entrance to Thork's kingdom. Stay close to me, Louise, at all times. Look out! Survey me again. Do you understand? Stay close to me this time. Dogs, these are harder. is looking for us, Louise. If he finds us, we're dead. Loading. Those dogs are a lot harder because they move a lot more and because I'm not wearing headphones, it's harder to tell exactly where they are. So we've now got a horse with us. You'll see why in a minute.
Too many of them. Quick, Louise, get in the saddle. Loading. Guide me through the trees. To avoid obstacles, press the key corresponding to the direction Louise points to. To jump, press up. yourself. Press the F key. You can repel an attack with your shield using the G key just before being struck. If you succeed, the enemy will be destabilized and you can hit him several times in a row. Let you hear 
the next little bit. Loading. Fishermen saved you. We have been in their village for two days. Two days? We have to get back on the road. We have to cross the ice mountains and the dry lands to reach the sea. It's the only chance to reach Thork Citadel without being seen. Okay, and that's all I'm going to give you. So that was a demonstration of a blind legend. I hope that everybody enjoyed the demonstration. And if you want to know more, feel free to comment or on my YouTube or on my Facebook or wherever. And I look forward to hopefully people liking it and stuff. I hope you all enjoyed this. I didn't want to say much during the demonstration because I wanted you to get the full immersive experience of the audio. So I hope you all enjoyed it. And as I said... Get the game and give it a try if it's something you think you might like. Thank you for listening, everybody, and I look forward to people's views, and I will be coming back with another video soon.